right, anyway, Valentine's Day is usually filled with chocolates and candies, but it doesn't always have to be unhealthy. Recently, we had a special guest stop by with some better, but still yummy, options. You don't need a significant other to celebrate Valentine's Day. I mean, who is more significant than your friends? Right. No one, I think. <laughs> Here to help us plan a healthy Galentine's Day with your gal pals, please welcome Mia Sin. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. What a beautiful spread oh, here. Thank but you. I'm more excited about the food, like I always yes. am for any party. Yeah, so you don't have to be um, single to enjoy Galentine's Day. It's mm -hmm. for everyone, whether you're in a relationship or not. Uh -huh. So, this is my first tip for hosting a perfect okay. Galentine's Day is a popcorn bar. Now, popcorn so is a great snack. It's it's fiber rich, it's a whole grain. Mm -hmm. So I make my easy own. to make. <laughs> easy to make. Add your kernels to your pot, uh -huh. and then I'll add the Thrive Algae Oil. And this is a great oil because it has the highest amount of monounsaturated fats than any other oil. Algae oil? Wow. Algae okay. oil. Nice. And it has a high smoke point. You can use it for a bunch of different applications. Mm -hmm. And then here, I'm going to have you kind of personalize your okay. favorite. So once this is cooking, you can um, add your favorite toppings. Oh, the chocolate chips? Chocolate. Yes, please. Yes, please. Those are. Because you got to tell me, given. chocolate is something good, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, dark chocolate. Fibers, all the way. something about like that. Antioxidants. And there you there go. We go. Dried blueberries. Oh, beautiful. Yum. So you would just add your own, like a little exactly. martini bar, but you're doing your own little popcorn exactly. bar. I love that. That is so cute. Okay. And then the radishes. This guacamole, first of all, smells amazing. Oh my gosh. I love guacamole. I'm from California, of course. Oh, so perfect. That's yes. like, it's in my blood. But um, so the next tip is to center your appetizers around crunchy pink radishes oh, cool. because they're low in calories, mm -hmm. high in vitamins, minerals, and filling fiber. And so these are avocado radish crostini, super Beautiful. easy to make. And I use these dandy fresh cut radishes. They're sliced for you. They also come in mini sticks and coins. So you can toss that in a salad. Oh, nice. It's like a beautiful Valentine's Day uh, Has salad. a little crunch there. I love little that. Crunch. All right, brownie bites. Got to be one of my favorite treats. So what do we so got here? These brownie bites are sweetened exclusively with medjool dates mm -hmm. and pomegranate juice. So really? I'm, pomegranate juice. So I'm going to add some to this batter. This is the okay. medjool dates and the flour, and this is 100% pomegranate juice, no wow. added sugar. It's my you palm just mix wonderful. it up. Mix that up. Um, and pomegranate juice is one of the highest sources of um, antioxidants. Oh my and goodness! And there's certain studies that show it helps with your memory, cognition, yes. athletic performance. That so is you're a put great that tip. Because these tin. taste just like the really probably exactly. really bad for you ones. <laughs> and <laughs> and, and medjool dates are so naturally sweet on their own. I add them to all Dates my are my favorite. Great for raw desserts too. Right. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay. All right. So finally, you can cheers to your favorite girlfriends with yes. some wine. But you're and doing so, it a little more healthy way. Yes. Yeah, so this is a spritzer. Uh, three ounces of sparkling water, three ounces of the Pasqua Romeo and Juliet wine. And uh -huh. these are made in Verona, Italy, mm -hmm. which is where, you know, Juliet and Romeo's story unfolded. Of course. And I love this label because it's the um, famous graffiti wall uh -huh. at Juliet's house where people write oh, love yeah. notes. So it's really romantic. That is really cool. Yeah. And so, and then having it be a spritzer is a little bit um, less calories, I understand, exactly. as well. Exactly. And you can garnish it with some fresh fruit, so like pomegranate or berries. Well, I just, I have to taste it to make sure. Oh, just yeah. to make just sure. Just to make sure. Mm. Mm. Too. <laughs> yeah, and you still get the taste of wine, you still get the sweetness, but it yes. had that sparkle in it because exactly. you had the sparkling it water. It makes it fun, too. All right, well, cheers right, to cheers. Valentine's Day. Cheers to Valentine's Day. And again, you can do it in a more healthy way. You can follow Mia at Nutrition by Mia.